Greetings friends, it's Friday, a beautiful day, which is much appreciated. I've not been feeling too well, I've just come out to finish off the wind turbine. Greetings YouTube, it is Friday and I'm very pleased to say that the three kilowatt motor is in uh, almost perfectly, I think as, as perfect as I'm gonna get it. There you can see that's the now the front side of the motor held in by those brackets and four bolts. That's the rear side of the motor. And it took a while because obviously it involved this motor before the gear cog was at the front but because the turbine's uh, pointing up into the air about five degrees I wanted it so any runoff uh, shouldn't go in here it's less likely to go in at that point on this end I couldn't find a washer to fit in that bit there exactly but I'm definitely feeling good about those brackets it's a lot more solid than it was before more importantly it feels very good to turn so I'm just gonna use my finger to do that so that's just one finger and remember that it's an overdrive of 1.55 to 1 that's as fast as I can really turn it by hand but I just wanted to show you that But that feels really good. What I'm going to do is just swap the other wire over, uh, the blue one. I've got those two connected to the AC multimeter. And what I'm going to do is just going to swap over for the other wire just to check it's producing around the same. So that's the blue and the green one now. It should read about the same. There you go. So yes, my friends, that is good news. That is very good news. It's in there super solid. It is a three kilowatt electric bike motor hub, whereas the one that's just come out is a one kilowatt. Didn't have to take the tail off at all. It's very heavy. So that was good. So I'm really happy with that and next time you see it it'll be up in the sky and I'm confident the 3 kilowatt motor will be a very good power producer in the long run in the winter. Cheers.